Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. I got an Atari Flashback 4 with 75 built-in Atari games and wireless controllers. It's going to be replacing my Flashback 3. And I got to thank Loot Crate for helping me get this today. Head over to go.tagjag.com slash Loot Crate if you want to start receiving geek goodies every month. Not only did they add more games to the Flashback 4, but they kept backwards compatibility with the wired controllers. And according to reports, paddle controllers will be available for this thing soon. And that's a good thing because some Atari games were optimized for paddle control versus joystick. I spy with my little eye my favorite Atari game ever. Adventure. From the outside, the 3 and the 4 look exactly the same. We have RCA video and mono audio connectors. Both of the controllers are wireless, but only one of them has a start, select, and reset button. Two AAA batteries per controller are all that's needed. It would help to have a precision screwdriver, too. Even with batteries inside, these things are extremely lightweight. Oh, and remember that with infrared, you have to be line of sight. Where do I begin? Space Invader. I'm having no issues with responsiveness. I remember about a quarter of these. I have no idea what the rest of them are. But I am going to have fun trying them all. Oh yeah, I gotta continue recording this video. Setup was simple, and gameplay is probably even more simple. These are the kind of games I love. What was your favorite Atari game? Even if you never owned an Atari, well, now you have no excuse. If you can find one. These things are popular. Go figure. And again, I have to thank Loot Crate for helping bring this into my house. I'll also put a link to where you can find the Flashback 4 online in this video's description. Go.tagjag.com slash Flashback 4.